Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to another video on the Geekband.com channel. Uh, today we are going to solve or almost try to solve the email problems of some Xiaomi Redmi Note 2 that have problems with the email. They have a wrong email, two wrong emails. So we are trying to solve this problem today. First thing you have to do is you have to go to this web page. This is the Geekband.com blog and you have to download these three files. I'm gonna leave you the links in the description. Uh, you have the first thing you have to do is to download these three files. I have the three files here in the desktop, uh, but I have to tell you, uh, just in case uh, you have any problem during this process, you have to know that you are not going to lose the warranty of the mobile phone with Geekbang. So this is a very fast method to solve this problem but if you have any problem during the method or if you don't want to use this method you can send the smartphone to Geekbind but you know you have to send it to China so we think that this method you have to do it at home that it will be more quick if you want to solve the problem of your own uh, but you have to notice that you are not going to lose the warranty of the smartphone with it with this method the first thing we have to know is to uncompress and install the drivers. The empty key drivers are these, so you have to uncompress it, these two files. Now we have the, these two files uh, uncompressed in the desktop. Oh, yeah, you can put it wherever you want, but I think that in the desktop it's, easy, it's easier. I'm going to do it like this. But first, I have to tell you that what we are going to do right now is to install the drivers, the MTK drivers. But you have to know that this method is not working, I don't know why, but it's not working on Windows 8 and on Windows 10. You have to do it on Windows 7 or on Windows XP. So I recommend you to do it this on Windows 7 or on Windows XP, as you, as you can imagine, of course. So we are going to SP driver and now we are going to open this file driver install. Now this is next. Next again and install. Once we finish to install these drivers, these MTK drivers, we have to reboot our computer. So I'm going to reboot and continue with this tutorial. Now we are going to this third file, this third compressed file, we click and we are going to uncompress this file. Now we are going to this folder, this SN right folder and we are going to uncompress the file that we can find inside. So we go inside this folder, we are going to output and we are going to click in this SN Writer app. We run the app and with this app we are going to solve the problem of the email. You have to be very careful but it's very easy. Now we are going to click in System Config and we click in this MD1DB and we are going to look in the folder in Images this VPLG, well, this file that I'm clicking right now. We select this file and we are going to open. Now we are going to APDV and we select this first file, this APDV, the first one, not the second one, because you can find two. You have to, you have to know that you have to click in this dual image selection. Now we're going to click on start. And now we have to rewrite, to write again, the emails of the smartphone. So, this is very simple. The smartphone has arrived to you with a wrong email and you have to write again the correct email of the smartphone. You're going to find this email in two places. You can find it in the back part of the box of the smartphone or you can find it under the battery. If you remove the battery of the smartphone, you can find it these two emails that are the same. So we are going to put the email here 
and now you have to do this. You have to, at first, to turn off the smartphone, to remove the battery, this is very important. You have to remove the battery, and then you have to click OK. And once, and now we are going to solve this. Well, I'm going to explain you how you have to do it. You have to first turn off your smartphone, turn off your Xiaomi Redmi Note 2. You have to connect the smartphone to the computer and to remove the battery. Or you can connect the smartphone to the computer with the battery removed, of course. Once you have the, the smartphone connected to your computer with the battery removed, you click OK. In this case, you click OK. And once you click OK, you have to put the battery on the Xiaomi Redmi Note 2. And that's it, you don't have to do nothing more. I'm going to repeat, you have to connect your smartphone to your computer and once you connect it without the battery, once you plug it, you press OK and once you press OK, you have to put it the battery. And that's it, you don't have to do nothing more. And that's it, guys, this is all. Uh, once you do this, uh, this method, this tutorial, you, know, you are going to need just five minutes. We're not going to have more problems on your Xiaomi Redmi Note 2, almost related with emails. And this is all for today, guys. I hope you have liked and I hope to help you with this problem of your Xiaomi Redmi Note 2. Please, if you have liked this method, this tutorial, thumbs up. And subscribe to our channel if you want to see more products of our website. That's all for today, guys. I hope you have liked this video and I hope to see you soon. Bye-bye.